Hey Sophia, I want to type some matter in paint. Please tell me how to do so. You can use the text tool of paint to type in it. Can you help me in learning this tool? Sure, Romy. Let us learn in the chapter. Parts of Paint Window We are familiar with the paint software. It is used to draw and color. The main parts of a paint window are as follows. Quick Access Toolbar It contains shortcut buttons for commands. Tabs It contains various tools to be used in paint. Ribbon It contains tabs, groups and commands. Groups It contains a set of commands which are used under tab. Drawing Area It is a blank area to draw. Tools Group the tools group has total six tools which can be used to make the paintings more beautiful. We have already learnt about the fill with color tool and the eraser tool. Let us learn about some other tools. Pencil tool. The pencil tool is used to draw a free form drawing. The steps to use the pencil tool are as follows. Step 1. Click on the pencil tool. Step 2. Select the width and the color of the pencil from the size and the color options in the colors group. Step 3. Move the cursor on the drawing area. It will change to pencil shape. Step 4. Press and hold the left mouse button and drag it to draw the freehand drawing. Text tool. The text tool is used to write the text in the drawing area. The steps to use the text tool are as follows. Step 1. Click on the text tool. Step 2. Move to the drawing area where we want to write the text. Step 3. Press and hold the left mouse button and drag it till we get the size of the text box of our choice. Type the required text. Step 4. We can also choose the font size and style from the font group on the text tab. Color Picker Tool The Color Picker Tool picks the color from a picture and uses it for drawing. The steps to use the color picker tool are as follows. Step 1. Choose the color picker tool in the tools group. Step 2. Now move the cursor on the drawing area and click on the part of the picture from where we want to pick the color. Step 3. We will see that the color 1 option in the colors group has picked that color. Step 4. Now we can use this color in any other drawing. Magnifier tool. The magnifier tool is used to zoom in on a particular part of a picture. The steps to use the magnifier tool are as follows. Step 1. Click on the magnifier tool in the tools group. Step 2. Then go to the drawing area and click on the part of the picture which we want to zoom. Step 3. We will get a magnified picture. Step 4. For getting back the original view, just click on the magnifier tool. Brushes tool. The brushes tool is used to create a free hand drawing. The steps to use the brushes tool are as follows. Step 1. Click on the brushes tool. Select any brush from the list of 9 options. Step 2. Select any color of our choice from the colors group. Step 3. Move the pointer to the drawing area. Step 4. Press and hold the left button of the mouse and drag the mouse to draw different lines. Shapes group. The shapes group is used to make a shape on the drawing area. Let us learn about some tools in the shapes group. Rounded rectangle tool. This tool is used to draw rounded rectangles and squares. A rectangle is like a square but it is more stretched out on the sides. The steps to draw a rounded rectangle or a square are as follows. Step 1. In the shapes group, click on the rounded rectangle tool. Step 2. Click on the size option to select the thickness of the line and the color option to select the color in the colors group. Step 3. Bring the mouse pointer on the drawing area and drag the mouse to draw a rounded rectangle or square. Curve tool. The curve tool is used to draw curved lines. 
The steps to use the curve tool are as follows. Step 1. In the shapes group, click on the curve tool. Step 2. Click on the size option to select the thickness of the line and the color option to select the color in the colors group. Step 3. Bring the mouse pointer on the drawing area and drag the mouse to draw a line. Step 4. Click on the line and drag the mouse to get the curve we want. If we click above the line, the curve will be upward and if we click below the line, the curve will be downward. Similarly, if we click on the right or left side of the line, the curve will be towards the right or left side of the line. Polygon tool. The polygon tool is used to draw a polygon. It is a close figure bounded by three or more lines. Some examples of polygon are given alongside. The steps to use the polygon tool are as follows. Step 1. In the shapes group, click on the polygon tool. Step 2. Click on the size option to select the thickness of the line and the color option to select the color in the colors group. Step 3. Bring the mouse pointer on the drawing area and drag the mouse to draw a line. Release the mouse button. Step 4. Place the mouse pointer where the second line ends and click on the left mouse button. Second line connected with the first line will get drawn. Step 5. Similarly, draw as many, many lines as you want. At the end, click on the starting point of the first line to complete the drawing. Drawing more shapes. There are different ready-made shapes like the oval, the rectangle, the rounded rectangle, the triangle, the diamond, a star, an arrow, a call-out, a heart, the lightning, etc. present in the shapes group. Let us learn to draw these shapes. The steps to draw different shapes are as follows. Step 1. In the shapes group, click on any ready-made shape tool. Step 2. Click on the size option to select the thickness of the line and the color option to select the color in the colors group. Step 3. Click on the solid color in the fill option in the shapes group to fill the color in the shapes. Step 4. Bring the mouse pointer on the drawing area and drag the mouse to draw the required shape. Selecting a drawing. We can select a complete drawing or a part using the selection tools and move them to another place as per our requirement. The selection tools are present on the image group of the home tab. The steps to select a drawing are as follows. Step 1. Click on the down arrow of the select tool in the image group. Step 2. The options present on the select tool are as follows. Rectangular selection. This option lets us select the rectangular area of the drawing. Free form selection. This option lets us select the area of the drawing in any shape. Select all. This option lets us select the complete drawing. Click on any one option as per our requirement. Step 3. A dash rectangular selection box appears around the selected drawing. Step 4. Click on the selection area and drag it to the required place. Release the mouse button. The selected drawing will appear at the new location. Let's refresh. Tools in paint are used to draw different drawings and color them. The pencil tool, magnifier tool, color picker tool, brush tool and text tool are used to draw and edit pictures. Different shapes can be drawn using different tools of the shapes group. The curve tool is used to make curves. The polygon tool is used to draw a polygon. The selection tools are present on the image group of the home tab. Dictionary Curve A bent line or a surface. Magnify To make something appear larger than it is. Rectangle A four-sided closed figure with opposite sides equal. Triangle A three-sided closed figure. Polygon A closed figure bound by three or more lines.